Can you see how the mind creates the body? Yes. Yeah, definitely. Good. Good. Now, go, go, just go to the direct experience of the beingness, this here nowness, the pure, absolute direct experience of just now. Mm. Is that something separate from the body? Not really, no. Okay, let me rephrase that. Is that something separate from the um, vision of the body? Oh, yeah. It is, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. Good, good. Go there. I'm there. Yeah. Now, is there a body? One of two things yeah. will either happen. Yeah. One of two things will either happen. You'll either say, no, there isn't. Right. Or what you'll notice is the mind engaging again, trying to create one. Right. One of two things will happen. Right. And if you see either or both, that's fantastic. Right. Well, my first thought was just the beingness and being now and being, you know, because mm. I I do. Did you, you need to think your? Did you need to think your way there? To, to the, the body. To the being. To the being. To, no, no. 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 I mean, I'm sort of, sort of in a meditative state. You know, kind yeah. of. I kind of yeah. bring myself in. Sometimes. Okay, so back to the being. Now I'll ask you the question, what body? Yeah, I could almost see, feel my mind kind of like triggering to. Yep, trying to create it. Right. It's trying to create it. Right. <laughs> it's incredible how this yeah. is all strung, strung together, yeah? It is. Yeah. Now, come back to the beingness. Does it have a location? Uh, I almost want to say everywhere. My first thought is, is everywhere. My second thought is, yeah, it's on, you know, I'll put you, I'll pinpoint it on a map. If you could pinpoint it on a map, where would it be? Well, in Southern New Jersey, uh, you yeah, know, as we call it. <laughs> and if we went in closer and closer and closer and closer and magnified in and in and in and in, yeah? And there's a beingness just here. Does that beingness have a location? I go to everywhere. Let's come back to the body. Is the beingness in your right foot? No. Is it behind the eyes? Yeah. Ah, so it has a location. Mm. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Okay. Now, the mind just created that location. Mm. Okay. Now, I'm going to change the word. 
go deeply into the awareness that's apparently behind the eyes. That awareness, does it have a location? Nowhere. Hmm. Is it behind the eyes now? Uh, I mean, I want to say, I guess it is, but it's really nowhere. That's the, the, <laughs> nowhere is the right answer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's a good thing that was my first answer. <laughs> mm. Mm. Now, from this point of awareness, or this point of beingness, yeah, from there, from there, that's where you get to see the mind constructing seeming things. Mm. And that that the mind is constructing has been, up till now, taken to be true and real. Now the question is, is it true and real? Is it true and real what the mind is constructing? Correct. Uh, no, that's not... That's not the truth. That's not when I look at Good. the truth that, Good. like we wrote in an email, the truth is my guide. It's no. Good. So the mind constructs a lee. Is that true? Oh, yeah. Okay, so the mind constructs a Lee. Now, the next question is, is the Lee that the mind is constructing true? No. Just like not the body. Right. Yeah? It's not true. Right. Yeah. So the illusion of what the mind throws up has to be seen through because as we identified right from the very beginning yeah the problem is mind the problem is thoughts now what if all of those apparent problems that the mind is throwing up are not true yeah and i try to i try to stop that thinking you can't. It's, you can't. That's not the aim. Mm -hmm. yeah. The aim is to see that you are not that. Mm -hmm. yeah. Until we know better, we believe that the mind is talking about me. And it's not. The mind's talking about itself. It's the mind that creates a me, and then there's which is constructed with thoughts, and then there's a whole other pile of thoughts around that constructed me, or around those thoughts of a me. It's all thought, right? Yeah. The thought me is here. Is that true? No. Good. The thought, I have a body. Is that true? No. No. <laughs> the thought, I am depressed. Is that true? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> yeah. Right. Good. Now, let's see if we can eliminate the body a bit more. Yeah.
just being or just awareness, if you want to call it that. How much of your body can you be aware of at any given point in time? Well, aware of. Yeah. That. Yeah. I feel like there's a, there's a catch there. <laughs> um, well, no, there's not. There's, there's not. No. All right, all right. Let, 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 let's okay. assume we have. Let's assume for a moment we have a body. Yeah. Right. Right. Okay. Good. How much of your body can you be aware of at any given point in time? I can be aware of all of it. Really? Examine that. That's why I was saying, is it a, is it kind of like a no, awareness I'm, of... No, no, no. I'm trying to... I'm trying to get you to see what the mind will construct with that question. Mm -hmm. See, How much? if awareness is, is viewed through the mind, through the filter of the mind, yeah... Right. Let's assume that's the case, right? Now, how much of your body can you be aware of at any given point in time? How much of my body? Like what yeah. what parts of my body or the whole parts what? Yeah, I mean I can be aware of my whole body. Okay. At any point in time. Okay, so let's have the have the awareness or the attention go to your left foot. Right. Just aware of just aware of that. Yeah. Right. Good. Whilst being aware of that, are you also at the same time aware of your right ear? Uh, I have to kind of switch a little bit. My Good. Ear. Good. Now remember, I said when awareness goes through the filter of the mind, the mind divides. Mm. It divides. That's its nature to do that. Yeah? Mm -hmm. So from the point of view of the mind, how much of the body are you aware of? Watch the mind. Watch it. Point of view, a point of view of the mind. Yeah. How much of the body... Can you be aware of? Well, I, I can be aware of <laughs> little sections or, you know. Sections, good. Can you be aware of the whole through the filter of the mind? Yeah, I, I can. I mean, I can kind of, you know. I so, have to kind so of... well, when you say I can, were you aware of your hair follicles? When you say, no. I can. No. Good. No. Good. So we come back to the question. How much of your body can you be aware of through the filter of the mind? Yeah, just portions. It's, yeah. isn't it? Right. Yeah. 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 So based on that, given it's the mind saying, I am the body, or, you know, me is the body, yeah? Which bit? <laughs> <laughs> According to the mind. Right. I mean, the mind will get tricky and say, oh, the, all of it, yeah? And you right. go, okay, okay, mind, let's be aware of all of it and see if you can be aware of all of it, mind, there's only mind saying I have a body and I'm aware of all of it. Right. Right. Yeah. I mean, I think of you know my limbs or you know. Yeah. Yeah. Just exactly. Like it that. divides. It separates out. Mm -hmm. Now, let's go to your right foot. This is a test for the mind. Yeah. Go to your right foot. Are you aware of your right foot? 
mind? Yeah. Okay. Let's go to your, the, the smallest toe on your right foot. Are you aware of that toe? Yeah. Are you aware of your heel at the same time? Not at the same time. I got to... No. Shift the attention. Shift the attention, right. Yeah. But it's mm-hmm. all that's really happening is the concept is being shifted. Now, right. if I bring if I bring you back to pure awareness, without the filter of the mind, what you come up with is no body. <laughs> Don't you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So for, for a moment, re- for a moment. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. And the, the reason I've taken you through that exercise is to show you what the mind seems to create. Mm. Mm. See, for you to have a body, the mind has to say, I have a body. And here it is. The mind would say that. Thoughts would say that. If there were no thoughts, I have a body, would there be a body? Uh, If there were no thoughts, would there be a body? Hmm. No. So it's thoughts that create the idea of a body. Right. Good. It's thoughts that creates the idea of a me. Right. It's th- good. It's thoughts that create the idea of other me and something else. Right. Because yeah. if they all collapsed and there was just pure unadulterated awareness, then what would there be? I. <laughs> The pure unadulterated awareness would be bliss. <laughs> you know, would be... <laughs> yeah. Well, you don't know that. That's I, an no. idea. That's an yeah. idea. Yeah, that's an idea. Right. Drop right. that. Drop that. Right. If all thoughts ceased and all there was was pure, absolute pure, unadulterated, obviously unadulterated because their mind is absent, awareness. Now what would there be? Remember, we live in a in an apparent world, right? So all right. thoughts have stopped, all thoughts have stopped, and all you're experiencing is pure, unadulterated awareness. Now what would there be? There's no body. Yeah. The question is, what would there be? Not what, what would there not be? What would there be? Good question. I mean, I, 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 like I said, I went, I went to bliss. I went to sort of uh, uh, it's almost indescribable. Yeah, because it would only be the mind that would step in and attempt to describe it. Right. But the mind, but good. But the mind is absent. Remember. Right. Now, what would they be? Just beingness. You could say just this. You could also say pure unadulterated awareness. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. Sure. Right. Yeah. Right. And you're living that. It's there. Yeah. It is there. That awareness is there. You can't sit there and tell me you're not aware. You have to be there to tell me you're not aware. <laughs> right. So, the, so the awareness is. 
Right. You could call it beingness if you like, but the, the awareness is. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Now, the only mistake that's being made is this awareness, mind has been calling me. Mm -hmm. 